Renegades. So that's it. Neo and the others couldn't tell the difference between the Designs and the Renegades. We've been waiting for you. Are you saying you were expecting us to come here? Does it really matter? We have more important things to discuss, such as joining forces. Unbelievable. You actually expect us to trust you after all you've done to Lloyd and Colette? The circumstances have changed. Ewan! Do you know of the giant Carlon tree? The legendary giant tree is said to have existed in the holy ground of Carlon, right? It's the tree of life which produces infinite mana. Isn't that just a fairy tale? The giant Carlon tree indeed existed, but the Carlon War exhausted its mana supply and the tree wilted away. And now all that remains is its seed left in the holy ground of Carlon. The seed of the giant tree is in the final seal? It is known as the Great Seed. Are you talking about the soul of Mythos? Now that is a fairy tale. The Great Seed, the source of the world's mana, is the seed of the giant tree. The Great Seed is absolutely vital in order to reunite the two worlds. Reunite the two worlds? I believe I told you before, Yggdrasil is the creator of the two worlds. Originally the world was one, but Yggdrasil ripped it asunder. How is it even possible for someone to split the world apart? It was possible for Yggdrasil, the two worlds of Manus to survive, by vying for the small amount of mana seeping from the Great Seed. So that's why the cycle of flourishing and declining continues, and the Chosen goes on the journey of regeneration. But if the Great Seed germinates, the giant tree will be restored and the cycle will come to an end. But how do we resurrect the giant tree? The Great Seed is nearly dead. We must expose it to a large amount of mana in order to save it. There's no supply of mana like that to be found anywhere in the world. Crucius's base, Daris Carlon, is a comet made from a giant mass of mana. It lies suspended in the sky high above this land. All we have to do is use that. Well, if that's true, why doesn't Eugrasiel revive the giant tree? All of Daris Carlon's mana is being given to Martell for the sake of resurrecting her. What? By using the power of a Crucius crystal, Martell's soul lives on, existing as a part of the Great Seed. If Martell awakes, the Great Seed will be absorbed into her and disappear. The reverse also holds true. In order to prevent that from happening, Yukdrasil protects the Great Seed with the seals of the Summon Spirits. So that's why the Renegades are trying to stop Martell's revival. Yes. We will make the Great Seed germinate. As a result, Martell will be absorbed by the Seed, and then... The giant Carlon tree will be reborn. If that happens, will the two worlds become one again? That I don't know. The only certainty is that the world will end if the Seed is lost. So, you're gonna have Miss Martell be a good little girl and disappear. Martell is already dead. If it weren't for Daris Carlin's mana, her soul would have disappeared a long time ago. Why is Yggdrasil so obsessed with Martell? That doesn't matter. What's important is that we see to it that the Great Seed germinates. Up till now, the Great Seed has been protected by the summon spirits of the declining world. The mana links. Correct. Now that the links have begun to unravel, the Great Seed's protection has weakened. Because we have been forming pacts with the Summoned Spirits of both worlds. Now I understand why you want us to join you. It's because we have Sheena, a Summoner. Ewan, are you with Crucius, or are you with the Renegades? I am with Crucius, and I am also the leader of the Renegades. A double agent? In other words, a traitor. So, what's your decision? Okay. Lloyd, you're going to trust him? Yeah. 
He's revealed the fact that he is a traitor. He's putting himself on the line. That has to mean something. I'll trust him too. You were headed towards Rhode Isle's ranch, correct? You sure know a lot about what we're doing. You have a spy watching us or something? No kidding. But either way, we have to stop that mana cannon thing before it's completed. We also have a debt to pay back to Rodile. The ranch and mana cannon system should be interlinked. Disabling the control room should be our first priority. You seem to know quite a lot about them. We have a reason to infiltrate Rodile's ranch as well. We can guide you to the entrance if you like. We're teaming up, right? Of course. Please take us there. Why are you going to the ranch? We need to make preparations to fire mana at the Great Seed. Oh, by the way, the Riyar Dimensional Transfer System will be offline while we make our preparations. You'll have to wait until after we infiltrate the ranch if you want to get back to Tetheala. Got it. Talk to Boda when you're ready. I'll leave the rest to you, Boda. Understood. <laughs>